Link. 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 Do not, Do not think, think that Hyrule is now, is now safe from the spread of twilight. twilight. Leave these woods and go to the west, where you will find the land protected by the spirit of Elden. There you will find those you seek. But know that these lands lie in twilight. They are now a dark realm covered by the clouds of dust. If you set foot beyond the curtains of twilight, you will revert to your beast form, so be prepared. Hero chosen by the gods, leave these woods and go west to the land of the spirit Elden. That's better. Searching should be much easier now. Hey. <laughs> But of course, you feel the need to go help the other light spirits, don't you? Well, don't worry, when you turn into a beast again, I'll take good care of you. The first thing you need to do is find the land covered in twilight. Once you do, I'll help you out. <laughs> See you later. She says that all the time. Hello, fellow gamers, welcome back for more Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. Kevin J2010 here. In the last episode, we defeated the Twilight the Parasite Diababa. I almost forgot what its title was. And we are here, we are back here in Farron Woods, and we just had to talk to Farron for a really quick sec, as he told us to go heading west out of Hyrule, I have to head to the west to go to the land run by Elden. So as you can see, I'm going the right way here. And... I love the 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 high rule theme in this game. It sounds so awesome. It's very cool. Oh yeah. Anyway, let me please tell me you dropped a blue rupee. <gasps> oh my god, a yellow rupee! Anyway, I had to. Come on, I have to freak out about it. Oh snap! Here we are in High Rule Field. This is kind of like the hub of the game. If the game was a dungeon, this would be the hub. Because it connects to just about everywhere in Hyrule. Because Ordon Village and Farron Woods were just in a little corner of Hyrule. This is actually like, this is the center of everything in this game. Um, obviously there's a few things we can do here real quick. Um, first thing we can do is we can get a whole new collectible right now. As you can see there's this little white dot on this tree. See that little white dot? You can collect that. We got the male beetle. This is the third collect. This is the second collectible. Sorry, in the game they're called golden bugs, and there's two of every type of bug: one male and one female that are golden. Um, they're scattered throughout Hyrule Field, and for the most part, they're all in Hyrule Field. There's a few that break that trend, but most of them are in Hyrule Field, so you can expect to find most of them there. Um, as you can see, there's actually a couple things to collect here, because if you look up right here, you'll see. What is that? Is that what I think it is? It's a piece of heart, or a heart piece, or whatever you want to call it. One more, and we will have a full heart container. Oh, it was a blue rupee, and I didn't even get to... Oh, it was a blue rupee! Ah, anyway. We're still not done here in Hyrule Field as of yet. Because remember how I said there's two of every golden bug? Well, if you come over here to this little island here... See if I can... Kargarok! No, two Kargaroks, Jesus. Bam! Get out of here. Anyway. Um, I said there was two of every type of golden bug. Well, if you look over here, there's a little white dot right there on the tree. You can pull it in, and it won't necessarily... You won't get it right away. You have to kind of follow it a little bit. Ah! Oh, come on. There we go. And we get the female beetle. Um, usually the same, well actually every golden bug the counterpart of it, if you get a male one you'll find the female one and the female one you'll find the male one they're all generally found very close together oh no oh my god look at that 
Who is this dude? He's running right in the... He ran right between the bomb. He's a genius. Go no further. There's a black wall ahead and blocks the way. I thought I would deliver a few letters, but it seems impossible. I am the honorable and dependable letter carrier, known to some as the postman. Now that I've introduced myself, please take this letter and read it at your leisure. To read a letter, press plus and open the collection screen and select the letter. You can see... You can do that to read any letters you receive. Do it whenever you see fit. <laughs> well, my business is concluded. Onward to mail. <laughs> he is also going to be an on-running joke this whole Let's Play. Oops, I did not mean to save. Anyway. Go into the letters here. We get a letter from the postman. If I have a letter for you, I it just basically tells you how he works. Anyway. Continuing on, we now have both of the beetles in this part of Hyrule. Um, also, every pair of them are also found within the same collection, like within the same area, so keep that in mind, too. And, oh, what do you know? We're already here at the Wall of Twilight. Jesus! There was a lot of stuff in this grass. Holy crap. I, I, I'm sorry. That is a lot of stuff. Oh, my God. Anyway, what is Midna going to say here? Hey, it was much closer than I thought. You remember, right? You know what this is. If you get if you set foot in there, you might you might be a wolf again for quite some time. For at least as long as it takes for you to save the light of Elden from the twilight anyway. So shall we try to go see the light spirit of Elden? Hey. Okay. Let's go. Want me to let you into the twilight? Yes. We still have like another seven minutes in this episode. We can probably get a lot of it done. Oh god! I thought that hand was really creepy. Oh, we're a wolf again. And a wolf run into the light. This is a good boy. That's a good boy. Wow, I don't know why I said this is. That's a good boy. Now, you need to listen to what I have to say from now on. Ah, look, how lovely. The black clouds of twilight are so fetching today. I feel so much more at ease here. And if you look so much better like this than those dusty old clothes, anyway. <laughs> so let's get going. Anyway, so now we have control of Wolf Link again. I know, we did a whole dungeon with Link and we're already back in this wolf form, which is one of the people's biggest complaints of this game. What's that? Is that the wooden sword? We have a metal one now. You can sniff it by hitting the A button. <gasps> it's Talos. And Mallow. And Beth. And Colin. We learned the youth scent. See, isn't being a wolf more convenient? Now use blah 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 to hone your senses. And you can start sniffing out where everybody is. Pretty cool idea. Uh, it makes sense because that's what a dog would do, or a wolf in this case. Any sort of. Whatever genus they're a part of. Oh, oh, we got surrounded. We got one of these things going on. Uh, bam! Took all three of them out in one go. Okay. Let me just put my. What's this? That's strange. The bridge is gone. I wonder if this is the work of those shadow creatures. Ah, what a pain. Oh, well, let's look for it. You get your map out. So you hit one. Take your map out. The yellow arrow marks where, you, you, marks where we are. You knew that, right? Whenever you destroy those creatures from the darkness, a portal opens that looks like this portal. You hear me? It's called a portal. You'd better remember that. And in those woods we came through. Yes, it's got to be around here. Use my power to take you to the location of the open portal. Pick where you want to go. So you're going to want to choose North Farron Woods here. And we can actually start teleporting. Um, out of all the Legends of Zelda games, I find this one is the most intuitive for warping. Because it seems to take you just about everywhere you need to go. Nothing seems out of the way or anything. See, I told you we're here. You know, most people can't leave the twilight that easily. You'd better be grateful. It's your job to look for the bridge. Look hard. 
Yeah, so we're gonna have to... Oh, wow, I found the bridge. Get me now. Wow, it's perfect, don't you think? And we're gonna want to warp. Good little obedient wolf. And we're gonna want to go back to this portal we opened up over here at Kakariko Gorge. Wait, Kakariko, that sounds familiar. Yeah, whatever. Yeah! <laughs> I, li I like that yell. That this game has, like, sound effects that that I always remember when I play it. Very few games have something about them that I feel I'll always remember them from having. Like, Star Fox 64. I can remember almost every quote from that game, and I just always remember how they say it. And in this case, it's about... Yeah, and in this case, it's all about, you know... Ah, uh, what am I trying to say here? In this case, it's all about sound effects. I always remember this game for the sound effects that a lot of the characters make. The mailman, if you listen, you heard him go like a doo 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 doo. It was funny. See, just as I thought. <laughs> so, isn't the power of Twilight amazing? Call me if you need the power again. It should help. It should help you find what we're looking for, don't you think? All right, let's keep going. Okay, let's keep going. We're getting a little low on time here, but I'm just gonna keep running. You got Twilight Boca Blends. Pretty simple. Stupid thing about Wolf Link is he doesn't have a finishing move, unlike Standard Link does, so it's really, really annoying. And if you get up here, you'll notice, oh, it's locked. And there's some Boca Blends on the other side. What are they doing here? This is a pretty elaborate gate. What are we going to try to try to keep in or out? It's worth our while to dig through there. See, like, he's gonna land on the ground. I can't jump on top of him because we don't have a finishing move. I don't know what Midna sees in my wolf form. And did he drop anything? Oh, he's not gonna drop anything? Ah, oh, that sucks. Anyway, we're gonna continue on. Let's see where we end up. Huh? Kakariko Village. Oh no, I'm already surrounded. Uh, I won't be able to lock onto all of them here. I'll take out that one first. And then I'll try to group these two together. Come on. Come on. The great words of Scorpion. Get over here. There we go. They're taken out. And we've now opened another portal that we can now use. To the hero who is transformed into a blue-eyed beast in the realm of shadows in twilight. This way. <laughs> 